Hi guys, I'm Marcy Jones, and I'm here to tell you about Marcy's Marvelous Wheel Chocks that are now being produced by uh, Sullivan Products. As you can see, we've got a, a, a trike plane here, and I've got all the wheels and axles on the Marcy's Marvelous Wheel Chocks. The purpose of these chocks are for travel when you're transporting your plane back and forth from the flying field, and also storage in the winter time to keep your tires from going flat. Those are the biggest uh, uh, factors. Here is what you get from Sullivan. The two uh, chocks with uh, holes and sliders in them, the screws, instructions. The point is to get the axle into one of these slots and then secure the plane. Uh, if, you, if you've got a van or a truck, you might have a board like this, have uh, uh, one fixed on this end and then, you know, have different screws and, or different shocks. Um, you know, you can just have one shock and move it from here to here to here to, for different airplanes. Or you can, you know, keep them uh, together if you want. Now I'm going to show you uh, a couple of examples of different planes I've got here in, in one of my shops. So we'll just take a, a trip over here and look at these. Here's an example of um, uh, wheel pants or no wheel pans. But you see, the, the point is you get the axle into the little slot, and now no more flat tires all winter long. Um, now we can go over here and see a much bigger plane. And uh, here's an example of uh, a much larger wheel. These chocks will hold up to five inch uh, wheels, and we are working on a bigger version. Um, and. Uh, but with the, with the bigger wheel, you put it on the side opposite of the decals. Uh, over here is a smaller wheel inside a wheel pan, um, and you can put it on the side with the decals. But the whole point is, these tires aren't going to be ruined over the wintertime or just storage over the summertime. Um, you know how tires get flat if they're foam or out of balance if they're rubber. Uh, these totally uh, do away with that. So. Uh, in just a minute, we're going to take a look at uh, my trailer, and I'll show you uh, all sorts of different setups and planes that I have in there, uh, transporting around New England and New York. Okay, so now we're here to talk about uh, uh, the real use of Marcy's Marvelous Wheel Chocks. It's for traveling with lots of airplanes and no worry about damage whatsoever from uh, uh, your home to the flying field. But first, I want to thank Mission Trailers and Lucky's Trailers for this fantastic trailer that they helped me put together. Um, if you're interested, call Lucky's. Uh, they will help you out. Micah Whitney helped me uh, for two years putting this thing together. So now let's take a look and see what, um, how I use all those Marcy's Marvelous Wheel Chocks. Okay, so here we are inside my, uh, my great trailer by Mission. Um, and I have several airplanes all around the, the, the whole trailer, which you can't see just yet, but you will. Um, I have many planes pointing down, some planes pointing up, some planes on uh, the floor, um, and almost all of them are held in with the Marcy's Marvelous wheel chocks. Um, the whole point is you get the axle into the chalk, slide it backwards or forwards, and then secure the airplane with bungees or however you want to. I use bungees inside of um, uh, pipe uh, tubing, you know, so that I don't dent the fuselage. Um, so uh, now we're going to switch the camera around so you can see uh, various shots of uh, the wheel chocks in action. So you can see I've got uh, a couple of airplanes in here. I can go down the road 80 miles an hour, hit massive bumps, and everything is safe and secure. Never moves an inch. Here you can see I've got uh, some planes that are pointing up. Here's the bungees that I talked about. The uh, pipe foam stays right there, no matter what kind of uh, uh, traveling I'm doing. Uh, a couple more pointing up. You saw most of the airplanes over here on this wall pointing down. You know, gravity helps you either in this case pulling it back in the chalk or in that case forward in the chalk and that's the whole point keep that axle either backwards or forwards 
and secure it in. Here we've got uh, a whole Tiger Moth biplane. Don't even have to take it apart. It's all held in with the wheel chocks. And we're going to get a few real close-up shots of these chocks uh, and how the axles fit in them. Okay, so now here you can see the, the whole Tiger Moth is in the wheel chocks. The wheel chocks are screwed to the side of the trailer and slid down, secured. The axle is in the wheel chock, pulled forward by gravity, held to the side of the trailer with bungees. And as we come up, you can see I've got a piece of foam here with more bungees securing it. I've got some foam on the tail wheel so it doesn't get squished. And the whole thing rides just like this, no matter what the bumps, no matter what the speed, and it's safe and secure the whole trip. Okay, so here's an example of just on the floor. Many people uh, travel with their back of their trucks or car, whatever. Uh, in this particular case, I don't even have them screwed to the uh, floor because I have a bungee um, around, you know, through the wing tube down into a, a hook down here. So it, it can move around a little bit, but once again, it's safe and secure and um, no flat tires. Okay, so here we have a um, 27 percenter against the wall, axles down into the uh, front of the wheel chalk, secured by the bungees, uh, top and bottom, and stays nice and safe and no flat tires. Okay, so here we have an example of where I have um, a 29 percenter in one set of chalks, but I have another... Uh, uh, 27 percenter that will fit into the other chocks. I just simply uh, leave the chocks there so that whenever I want to switch planes I just pull one out and put the other one in and I'm ready to go. Okay so you can see it really doesn't matter whether they're pointing up or pointing down. This one's pointing up, slid back into the uh, slot, held with the bungees and the bungee and the foam back here and with foam around the tail wheel so it doesn't get squished. This thing will ride uh, safe and secure over any bump, any terrain. Okay, um, I've uh, given you quite a few examples. He here's uh, one more thing for you guys uh, who have uh, wheel pants that are too tight. These are some of my prototypes. Sometimes you may want to cut them a little bit. I just haven't had the heart to cut any of these new ones uh, that are nice and anodized yet. Uh, but feel free to modify them. Uh, make them uh, make them work for you. That's what's important. And uh, contact Sullivan um, or their distributors um, or their retailers for these Marcy's Marvelous Wheel Chocks. And once again, uh, thank you, Sullivan, for helping me out with this. And thank you, Lucky's Trailers, and thank you, Mission.